Now on day 63 of what was supposed to be a 10-day mission, NASA today said astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams may remain in space until February. Butch and Sonny would remain on station and become part of that increment and return home with them on Crew 9. Crew 9 is a SpaceX mission to the station set to launch in late September, returning next year. For months, NASA has insisted Wilmore and Williams are not stuck in space. Years behind schedule, Boeing's troubled Starliner launched on a test flight in early June. But Starliner has remained docked to the space station, with mission managers divided over whether it's safe to bring Wilmore and Williams home. Ground teams are still trying to troubleshoot Starliner's helium leaks and engine thruster problems. Starliner needs those thrusters for a safe return. Now NASA could bring Starliner home autonomously without a crew. Williams and Wilmore, both NASA veterans, recently insisted they're not worried. I have a, a real good feeling in my heart that uh, the spacecraft will, br will bring us home, no problem. In a statement, Boeing says it still believes in Starliner's capability and its flight rationale. If NASA decides to change the mission, it'll take the actions necessary to configure Starliner for an uncrewed return. That mantra you've heard, failure is not an option. That's why we are staying here now. A 10-day mission that could turn into eight months. So, Tom, let's talk for a moment about the optics of this. If NASA turns to Elon Musk and SpaceX to get the astronauts home, that would be kind of a big black eye for Boeing. A huge embarrassment. SpaceX has already flown nine missions to the station with astronauts. Boeing is struggling with its first. But NASA insists it is committed to Starliner and it believes the problems can be fixed. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.